scary ghost videos. Trapped. The first ghost video for today comes from TikTok, uploaded to the account Jezebel TikTok. The video was captured on a family's indoor CCTV camera somewhere in India and is apparently real footage of a quote poltergeist. After the family's daughter exits the room, the door she first came through mysteriously slams shut all by itself. Then, when the daughter tries to leave, the door that slammed shut earlier now appears to be locked, and the little girl frantically calls for help. All the while, the lights can be seen mysteriously flicking on and off, somehow on their own. Then, out of nowhere, a dark shadow can be seen slowly approaching the girl. The mysterious shadow can be seen getting closer and closer before her mother manages to get the door open and the shadow then vanishes like it was never there. TikTok viewers have been left shocked by this clip, with many saying that whatever this is, is a demonic spirit attempting to possess the girl. But what do you think? Is this a real ghost as the uploader claims? You tell me. The Apparition the next ghost video was captured on camera while a news station were interviewing a man live on TV. The interview has nothing to do with ghosts or anything paranormal, only about how the man went from broke to now being rich. Something white can be seen moving in the background, but what is it? The mysterious white thing appears on one side of the screen before quickly drifting out of view. Eagle-eyed viewers were quick to notice the strange white mist hovering in the background, with many believing it to be the spirit of someone who had drowned in the swimming pool. But what do you think? Is this a ghost caught on camera as people claim? You tell me. The Farm this next ghost video comes from the popular Mexican ghost hunting channel, Extinct File, where they visit an old abandoned and supposedly haunted farm late at night. Many sightings of ghosts and paranormal events have been reported at the old haunted farm, and local residents say that the farm is so haunted that nobody dares to enter it. Kevin and Camera 2 start their paranormal investigation at the haunted farm, where they hear some very, very weird noises. However, a short while into their investigation, they decide to investigate the stables and capture this on camera. El medidor no me ha marcado nada, eh. ¿Hay alguien aquí? Buenas noches. No mames. 
Buenas noches, ¿hay alguien aquí? Si alguien vive aquí no queremos molestar para nada. Me siento... Me siento nervioso, güey. Muy nervioso. Es curioso porque... El medidor de campos aún no me ha marcado nada. Y lo vengo usando desde el inicio. Ya hemos captado algunas cuantas cosas. Está sonando el sensor. ¿Qué onda? No mames, ahí hay alguien asomado, güey. Ah, no mames. No mames. Se metió. ¡Hola! ¡Buenas! ¡Hey! Acabo de verte. ¿Quién eres? Acabo de verte. ¿Quién eres? As the ghost hunters are exploring the stables, Kevin's walkie-talkie begins to pick up interference. Then, seconds later, the ghost hunter's sensor placed at the other end of the stables triggers, which means something must be standing right by it. But when the ghost hunters shine their light to see what could have activated the sensor, no one can be seen. However, moments later, when the camera pans back, a mysterious dark figure can be seen peeking its head out before it quickly ducks out of sight. The ghost hunters notice it and Kevin calls out, who are you? But he gets no reply. But it doesn't end there. The ghost hunters decide to split up and investigate the haunted farm alone. Camera 2 explores outside with a K2 meter and an oculus type device, while Kevin chooses to conduct a ritual inside one of the rooms of the farm. He places candles in the shape of a cross, blindfolds himself and asks a series of questions. And then this happens. Ok. Paga tu luz. Quiero que observen cómo se ve sin la luz. Justo así puedes hacerme zoom. Que vean que no puedo ver absolutamente nada. Listo. No puedo ver absolutamente nada, familia. Así que esto me va a permitir agudizar más mi oído. Listo, güey. Nos vemos pronto. Cualquier cosa me avisas por la radio, ¿ok? Ok. Venga. ¿Cuál era tu nombre? Víctor. ¿Te llamabas Víctor? ¿Estás enojado, Víctor? Víctor, ¿estás enojado? 
No te pases de lanza. No sé qué sucedió, familia. Víctor. Sé que estás aquí conmigo. ¿Me puedes dar alguna señal? Sé que estás aquí conmigo. ¿Me puedes dar una señal? Ay, Dios. Me siento como desprotegido. Familia. Siento que Él está aquí conmigo. Siento una presencia cerca de mí. Ay, Dios. Dios, Dios, Dios. Siento que está aquí conmigo, familia. ¡No mames! ¡No mames, familia! ¡No mames, no mames! ¡Mira, ven, ven, ven eso! ¡Vean eso! ¡Se está moviendo esa madre! ¡Se está moviendo esa madre! Me, me acaban de jalar la mochila Me acaban de jalar la mochila y se movió esa madre Estoy seguro que esta cámara lo tiene La cámara Night Shot Estoy seguro que lo va a tener esta cámara, familia ¡Ay, no, 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 no! Tengo que ir ya con cámara 2 No, esto está, esto está muy, muy fuerte, familia ¡Ay, no, no! La presencia de aquí, no sé si es el hombre o es algo más, pero está fuertísimo, está fuertísimo, familia. Ay, no, Dios, 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 Dios. Dios, tengo que, tengo que ir con cámara 2. Ay, vámonos, vámonos. Ay, no, Dios mío, güey. Vámonos. Vámonos, güey. Ay, ay Dios, 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 Dios. Mi, mi linterna, güey. Oh. Ay, Dios. No mames, no mames, no mames, no mames, no mames. No mames. No mames, güey. Ahí hay alguien, güey. No mames. Ahí hay alguien. Te lo juro que acabo de ver a alguien. No mames, no mames. No mames, güey. Neta, acabo de ver a alguien aquí, güey. No, 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 no. Hola. No te pases, güey. Ay, no, 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 no. Y mi cámara justo, ve, justo en ese momento se apagó, güey. Justo en ese momento se apagó. No hay nadie, güey. Ay, no, 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 no manches. No, vámonos de aquí, güey. Eso no era bueno, güey. No es bueno, güey. Eso no es bueno para nada, güey. Vámonos, vámonos. Vámonos, ahora sí, ya, güey. As Kevin is attempting to contact any spirits that may reside on the farm, he begins to feel a presence, as if something we can't see is in the room with him. Then, out of nowhere, Kevin is violently pulled by something which understandably scares the life out of him. As a result of this, the pair decide to end their paranormal investigation at the haunted farm, but as they're leaving, Kevin's camera begins to malfunction. He manages to switch it back on, then captured on camera, a dark shadow a figure can be seen in one of the windows for a brief moment before it quickly disappears out of sight. Kevin and camera 2 rush over to check, but when they get to where the figure was just seen, there's no one there. Extinct Files viewers were left creeped out by this scary footage they captured at this haunted farm, with many warning Kevin that whatever pulled him could have potentially attached itself to him, and that he should seek help from God immediately. But what do you think? Did the Extinct File ghost hunting team capture evidence of paranormal activity at this old haunted farm? You tell me. Paranormal activity. The next ghost video comes from one of my favourite ghost hunting channels, Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations. The ghost hunters uploaded this creepy video at the beginning of December when they visited the Viaduct Tavern to conduct a paranormal investigation. The Viaduct Tavern was built in the mid 1800s, directly opposite a prison built all the way back in the early 1200th century. There have been numerous reports of paranormal activity at the Viaduct Tavern, which were reported by several of the owners dozens of staff and guests to the Viaduct Tavern over the years. Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations set up their equipment, including static cameras on each floor, pointing down the hallways, and within minutes, things start to get creepy. We've got a motion detector at the door there. If it picks up any movement, the light will come on. So can I speak to whoever it was 
that's here that levitated the carpet off the floor. Hello? Is there someone up there? There was like, I, I don't know what it was. Some sort of noise from on the stairwell or further up the stairs. Hello? The sound of a door moves from somewhere nearby. Here is the enhanced audio taken from Static Cam 3 covering the hallway. Hello? I can hear you. I can hear you walking. There was a few footsteps on the floor above us. As I stand on the stairs to the full floor, I hear footsteps above me on the floorboards. Here is the audio taken from Static Cam 5, which is located up on the fourth floor. Kate, hey, please come through. There you go. That's what I was hearing Shh. downstairs. Kate, okay, tell me your name, your full name. We can find out. Find out what happened to you and whether the person that did it was caught and punished. Jesus. Hey there. There was someone that stood by me. Okay. There's so much to go by me then. Oh, I don't know. That is the clearest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay, calm down. There. Okay. I was stood here. No. Okay. Okay. It was there.
Perhaps you can answer a question for us. Are these actual cells that were used in the Giltspur Street Compter? If you've been wrongly accused, can you speak into the red light and tell us what you want to say? If I knew your full name, I could look in the newspapers, the old newspapers, and find out what happened to the person that did that terrible thing to you. That's all I need from you, is your surname. So if I hold this out... Guys? Yeah? Yeah. Cool. Something's in that room. It just went past the window and I've got it on film. Something went across that window. Kate? As the team are alone in the tavern, a door on the third floor mysteriously opens and closes by itself. Then the sound of knocking and footsteps can be heard walking on the wooden floorboards on an upper floor. The team then make their way to the top floor of the haunted tavern, where supposedly the landlady's daughter witnessed paranormal activity. Phil decides to call out, and then suddenly Mark becomes startled by a figure standing right by him. And in the moment when Mark jumps away, he managed to capture the face of whatever was standing right by him. Captured on Mark's night vision camera, a distorted face of someone or something can be seen for a split second, but the question is, who is it? Then, as the ghost hunters are down in the basement, loud footsteps can be heard walking quickly on the floorboards above them, and their motion detector placed upstairs triggers by something we can't see. The team then move back upstairs and ask a series of questions, and then captured on Jeff's camera, a mysterious black shadowy figure can be seen quickly passing in front of a window, not once but twice. At first, it moves from right to left before moving back the opposite way. So, did Ghost Head Paranormal Investigations capture real paranormal activity at this haunted tavern? You tell me. Haunted. The last ghost video for this week comes from the YouTube channel Dino Nuggets 741. I've featured Dino Nuggets 741 several times before, where he encountered terrifying paranormal activity inside his previous home. Dino Nuggets then moved house, hoping the activity would subside, and for a while, it did. However, after some time, a terrifying paranormal activity that was a thing of the past begins to intensify. Hello? Hello? No, 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 no. Hello? 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 What do you want?
What the? Loud banging sounds can be heard coming from the upstairs of Dino Nuggets' house. Startled by this, he calls out, Hello, and a dark figure can be seen moving quickly at the top of the stairs. Dino Nuggets rushes upstairs, but the figure is nowhere to be seen. Then, as Dino Nuggets is upstairs, a door to one of his rooms can be seen slamming shut over and over again. He approaches the door with caution and opens it slowly, but there's no one in there. Dino Nuggets frantically searches his whole house, but doesn't find anyone. So what do you think? Is Dino Nuggets haunted by something evil, or is it all? All just for views, you tell me. As we finish off 2022, I'd just like to thank all of you for your kind words, incredible support, and for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos over the past year. We reached just over 62,000 subscribers in less than 8 months, which is absolutely amazing. When I first started this channel back in April 2021, I wanted to show the world the best, scary, creepy, and mysterious content the internet has to offer. I don't think I I've mentioned this before, but my reasons for going with the name Mind Junkie came from simply mysterious videos that'll mess with your mind. I tried numerous different types of videos, from when I first started the channel with videos such as top 10 most dangerous water slides to top 5 most haunted hotels in the world. Sadly, none of these were a hit, and it was only after I started to upload scary content did my channel take off as it has. So, with that said, I've been considering a name change for 2023 and beyond. If you guys have any ideas of names I could use, please leave them in the comments below. The winner of the best name will receive a prize. And yes, I do read each and every comment posted, and I'm not going to lie, many have been so touching that they've even made me shed a tear. You guys are just so kind, and I appreciate every single one of you. Your kindness and support has not gone unnoticed. At the time you're watching this video, I'm in the hospital for surgery. I'll try and get a video out next week if I can, but if not, have a very happy Christmas and a happy new year. Hopefully, I'll see you again next time.